We begin tonight with a developing story out of New York City. Multiple people are dead after what the New York City mayor is calling an act of terrorism. Yeah, Fox News correspondent Caroline Shively has the details in our top story tonight. Multiple fatalities and even more injured after a truck deliberately drives through a popular bike path in downtown Manhattan. Witnesses saying they first saw the truck plow through pedestrians and cyclists near the World Trade Center Memorial before eventually crashing into a school bus. He did have a noticeable limp as he was getting out of his car. He did look like he was dragging his foot a little bit and he was screaming and he was screaming in the street. He looked frustrated, panicked, confused. That suspect shot and apprehended by New York City police who say he was carrying an imitation firearm. According to police, he traveled nearly eight blocks in the truck and was yelling Allah Akbar when he exited the vehicle. Students from a nearby school describing the horrific scene. It surprised us because, you know, you usually never see something like this happening around here, especially around here. So, like, we just looked outside the window and they were just laying there, like, dead. We know that this action was intended to break our spirit. But we also know New Yorkers are strong, New Yorkers are resilient, and our spirit will never be moved by an act of violence, an act meant to intimidate us. Police saying the incident was first thought to be a case of road rage, but now is being investigated as an act of terror. President Trump has been briefed on the situation by Chief of Staff John Kelly and will be updated as more details emerge. Caroline Shively, Fox News.